Hello, my name is Valda Bailey. Uh, I'm a photographer stroke artist. Um, I've been invited by MMX Gallery to make a short uh, movie about um, what I do, why I do it, um, and include a little bit of footage from um, my studio. Not used to being on this side of the camera, so um, you'll have to excuse the ums and the ahs. So, um, one of the things about my work that really interests me is the ability to hand finish it in various ways. Now, a photograph can be reproduced a million times at the press of a button and um, each image will be absolutely identical. Um, because I, um, my first creative love was, was painting, um, the fact that a photograph um, is not hand finished in quite the same way and certainly not in the same way as it used to be when we were um, working in the darkroom, um, it troubles me slightly. So um, I've been um, working on various ways of, of making um, each photograph within a series unique in some small way. This led me to uh, investigate um, gold leaf, uh, the application of gold leaf, um, specifically uh, ver eglemise, um, which is the art of glass gilding. Now it's quite an involved process um, and it's taken no small amount of time and um, hard work to um, understand how it works, why it works and how it can best be applied um, in conjunction with photography. Um, now gold leaf comes um, in many different um, shapes and sizes if you like. Um, the shades have the most evocative names you could imagine. Rose gold, moon gold, lemon gold, citron gold. Who wouldn't want to work with such beautiful materials? Um, it's quite a long drawn out process, uh, requires a steady hand and much concentration, but it's enormously rewarding. Um, it also makes each image obviously unique because um, no two applications of gold leaf can ever be identical. Um, I also vary the, the way that the um, gold leaf is applied, so each, each image within a, a given, given series looks um, slightly different. Um, I'm drawn to the natural world, um, and although I really enjoy abstraction, uh, I like to try to retain an element of um, recognisability about what it is I'm photographing. Another image that I've been working on is inflorescence. Um, this was also shown at Photo London. Um, it's sort of celebration of spring and um, all the, the new life bursting forth. A blossom is such a wonderful thing to photograph, um, especially using the techniques that I do because you could just make clouds and clouds of this beautiful confetti-like um, stuff that um, is so precious because it doesn't last very long. Um, the Japanese have a wonderful word for it, they call it ohanami, and it's a celebration of transient beauty. Um, and because it's so beautiful um, and so perfect and so short-lived, lived, um, it's all the more special for that.